Let's take a look at your forecast. Here's Mary. Good morning, Gianna. That's right. It is a chilly start to our day, much colder compared to yesterday morning, and a gorgeous start. Check out our Salesforce Tower camera, that golden glow as we look east across the Bay Bridge and the East Bay, a very pretty sight. Let's check our temperatures because many of us down to the 30s and in the 40s this morning, uh, running about five degrees colder compared to yesterday at this time. So you can see our temperatures as we start off our day, those morning lows looking at 36 in Napa, 39 in Livermore, and for Mountain View, upper 40s for San Francisco, Oakland, mid 40s in San Jose and Pacifica as we start off our day. So clear and chilly as we kick off our Thursday. Plenty of sunshine, a bit warmer for today. Seasonal mild daytime highs, but the rain returns for our weekend. So two more dry days as high pressure is in control for us today and for tomorrow, and then changes ahead for our weekend. But for today, you can see that sunshine on Futurecast taking you hour by hour. That'll continue for your Friday as well. And then watch as the rain moves in for Saturday, tracking a cold front to move in Saturday and then a stronger storm system on Sunday, picking up about a half inch to an inch of rain for our weekend, that much needed rainfall. But for today, plenty of sunshine for the South Bay. We go 67 in Santa Clara and for San Jose and Campbell. For the East Bay, Concord, you'll see a high of 67, looking at 68 in Antioch, Brentwood, Fairfield, Tri-Valley, looking at 65 in Pleasanton, and for Livermore, around the Bay, 60 in San Francisco for a high for the East Bay from Richmond, Berkeley, Oakland, San Leandro, all topping out at 64 degrees, 65 in Napa, 65 as well for Ronard Park, and topping out at just 60 degrees for Lakeport. Here's the extended forecast, so plenty of sunshine continues tomorrow, and then a wet weekend ahead. Looking at the rainfall Saturday and especially on Sunday, also much colder on Sunday, unsettled weather into early next week.